بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم رب زدني علما okay the next thing we'll talk about subnet mask now generally when we try to assign like if you try to see here whenever i'm trying to assign an ip address so we we give the ip address here and on the bottom there is an option of subnet mask now subnet mask is mandatory when we assign the ip address because without subnet mask the device is not going to accept the ip address like if i try to give the ip here and if i try to remove the subnet mask and if i click okay the simply it says the tcp ip protocol you have entered the ip address without subnet mask or missing the subnet mask so please add the subnet mask here so basically subnet mask is going to differentiate the network and the host portions like when i when i specifically say when i write an ip address as 192.168.10.15 so when i when i ask you let's say okay Uh, how many network portions and how many host portions? We simply remember this saying that okay, 192 comes in the range of 192 to 223, which is in the C class range, and we learned that in the C class there are three network portions and one host portion. So basically, we say this, so which means these three these three are network, and this is the host portion. So similar way when we when we write any address like 172.16.15.15. by seeing this range we say this is a b class example and in the b class there are two network portions and two host portions but when we when we do that with the computers or any networking device so how the device is going to identify of course by seeing the subnet mask so whenever uh, you write we generally write the subnet mask of 255255250 so this actually tells how many network portions and how many host portions like here if i write 182.168.0.210 and if i press tab button like if you if you try to see here let's go and verify here if i simply try to assign the ip here any ip let's say any c class 192.168.10.5 it's a c class address and when i press tab button it automatically takes the subnet mask of 255255250 now basically what it says is so your operating system is designed to automatically take the default subnet mask of c class and in c class by default there are three network portions and one host portion so wherever there is one that is network wherever there is zero that is host so the subnet mask is going to tell how many network portions and how many host portions So when you write 255 here, which means there are ones, binary ones. 255 means binary ones. 255 means binary ones, right? And whereas zero means eight zeros. So wherever there is one that is network, which means this is network, 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 and host. So the same thing. So how the device is going to identify? The device is identifying based on the subnet mask. so when it sees the subnet mask of 255255250 means it will automatically understand that there are three network portions and one host portion so if i try to use any any b class then it will take automatically as 255255250 because it's a b class in b class we have two network portions and two host portions which means uh, wherever there is one that is network network and wherever there is zero that is host so the device is going to identify the subnet mask the range everything is uh, the, the device is going to identify the network portions and the host portions completely based on the subnet mask so similar way if i write any a class example here 10.0010 it automatically takes the subnet mask of 255 and this means that the network portion there is one network portion and there are three host portions so wherever there is zero that is host and wherever there is one that is network so by seeing the subnet mask the device will identify the network and the host and you can see here wherever there is one that is network and wherever there is one that is network and wherever there is one that is network so as per the default classes in is in c class the default we have three network portions and one host portion 
which means the default subnet mask will be 255.255.255.0. So the blue one represents network 1, 1 and 0. Remember that. Similar way in B class, we have two network portions and two host portions, which means the subnet mask, the default for the B class is 255.255.0.0. And for the A class, we have one network portion and three host portions. So the subnet mask will be 255.000. So these are the default subnet masks which are given. Of course, this can be changed. So when you change this, automatically the size will change. How to change will be seeing more on in the submitting concepts. So basically here we are not going to make any changes. We are just trying to understand the default values. Okay, so subnet mask is mandatory because that is going to tell how many network portions and how many host portions.